Better shake your booties for black girl nerves. Better shake your booties for black girl nerves. So ladies, congratulations. Uh, release day is very, very close for everyone to enjoy your, your latest project. Beginning with you, Adele, what I appreciate, I mean, all of the dialogue between the characters are, is beautiful and memorable, but there are so many moments that are so impactful where it's just them looking, the characters looking at each other or feeling things. As a writer, how do you make sure that is conveyed? What are the conversations like with the animators and the other creative people to make sure that emotional quotient is coming across? Oh, you know, thanks so much. I'm so glad you enjoyed it. Um, I would say, you know, for writing, um, it, it's never been a more collaborative exercise than it is in a Disney animated movie. And so, you know, so many of the dynamics that you mentioned, you know, whether it's between Raya and her father or Raya and Sisu or even Raya and Amari, someone she views as her enemy, but she has deep, you know, a deep history and childhood with, um, you know, all these things are discussed with the story team, with Osna, our producer, our directors, and really trying to get deeper, you know, um, um, for example, the character of Namari, who started out as, you know, a pure villain, we, um, you know, with the directors and our, our story trust challenging us of how do we make it deeper? How do we make this a character we have not seen before? How do we make her, um, you know, how do we make the, the relationship between Namari and Raya, um, you know, uh, speak to the larger story that we are trying to tell? And so it really helps having that allyship and that support of, you know, challenging you to how do you make it, you know, even more profound. Um, and I think, you know, uh, just to touch upon those relationships, what uh, we were so excited by, um, you know, Osna and I would look at each other in the room. Uh, we knew we had like a fe this female buddy cop dynamic between Raya and Sisu. And when we were looking at comparisons for other movies, um, it is rare, uh, if, if not existent, to have um, a female friendship at the core and heart of a major Hollywood movie. And, you know, we'd never seen it before and we were so excited by it. And also, you know, Raya's relationship with Namari as the villain, you know, that it goes deep and that it is complex, like the other side of female relationships. So, you know, this was something that the entire team was very excited about. Yeah, it, it really comes across it, the strong woman led story where the the uh, both characters are fighting for a common goal. They're just approaching it from different ways. And it, it's been, it's fascinating. I don't think it's as simple as like a protagonist and an antagonist because they really have the same goal. Just their approach to it is very, very different. Um, Asna, for you as the producer, what's the hardest part about waiting for release day to come for you? <laughs> well, fortunately I had plenty to do on the way to release day. Um, and I've been on the film for about four years. So for me that I could not be more excited that in the next few days we'll share it. You know, there's so many different phases in animation and so many amazing artists and it's a complex thing to put together. But then, you know, come last March and we were told to go home. So most of the production of this film was done from home and from 450 homes um, and all of those details coming together as well as keeping our sense of community and our ability to build on each other creatively and um, and honestly there was so much trust involved in bringing that and pulling that off and I can't tell you I have never been more proud of a crew in my life people really did something extraordinary. Mm -hmm. Adele when you co-write with with other people how do you guys lay that out, the task? Is it as simple as your character, their character, we meet in the middle? How do you work collaboratively with another writer to bring a story like this to life? Ah, well, you know, I think um, if you've been a TV writer for as long as I have, like collaboration is really the key to the game. Like th there is so much work to be done um, in a Disney animated feature. It takes five years to make. We have eight different screenings. So you are basically rewriting the movie eight times, you know, at a minimum. Um, in terms of working with other writers, you're right. It's not as simple as, you know, you write this character, I write that character, because it has to hold, a, hold cohesively as a piece. So it's a lot about communication. Um, you know, sometimes people think of writers as just like, you know, you're just scribbling on a, on a like tapping on a laptop by yourself. Absolutely not. Like, you know, you have an idea, you wanna make sure everybody's on the same page. You need to be able to clearly pitch your vision and your idea and also be receptive to the notes and the ideas that you are getting. 
Um, and as far as like Kui and I working together, I loved it because, you know, I like thinking about like, you know, the deep, uh, you know, the deep, profound, large messages. And Kui has this amazing background as a playwright coming up with like action and, you know, like smack talking, like, you know, um, um, uh, combatants um, and breathing so much life and fun and energy into it. So I think it's about finding, um, you know, a good match, finding complementary skills and also being really open. And we're not precious about ideas. It's best idea wins, whether it's for writing or for the entirety of the movie. That's awesome. Thank you so much, ladies, for your time. That was wonderful. And good luck and can't wait for other folks to see it. Thank you so much. Thank you. Better shake your booties for black girl nerds. Better shake your booties for black girl nerds.